season then this particular season has become the most <coughs> problematic season in india because already indian land is uh, which kind of climate india is tropical already temperature quite high but in present time due to global warming as well as el nino kind of condition more then temperature has been increasing a lot and this scenario is leading to which kind of condition in india heat wave frequency has been increasing in india a lot lot of news of heat wave in present time any one of you can describe heat wave how we describe the heat wave which condition we call heat wave when it tem whenever temperature increased above 4 to 5 degree celsius from the normal actually three conditions are there by imd imd declared the heat wave in the country and uh, according to imd uh, then three conditions are there in any given location if temperature has reached to 45 degree celsius then we it persists for a uh, few days then it would be called as heat wave condition so any place either increase or decrease in summer season if temperature reaches to how much 45 degree celsius or more than that then heat wave condition we will call irrespective of increase or decrease in temperature 45 is still very high that is abnormal temperature but if in any given area temperature normally remain 40 degree celsius or above that it is normal temperature average temperature but for few days if it is uh, increased to 4 to 5 degree celsius even then increase of that then we will call heat wave so for example if 40 degree celsius in any given location normally but 4 degree celsius increase 44 it becomes then it, it is it would also be called as heat wave 4 to 5 degree celsius increase and if we consider that in any given area normal temperature is less than 40 degree celsius for example 35 degree celsius normal temperature in any given location in summer then temperature increase by 5 to 6 degree celsius then it will also be called as heat wave for example temperature has reached to 40 degree or 41 degree from 35 then this area will also be called as heat wave condition for less than 40 how much increase should be there 5 to 6 for more than 40 4 to 5 and if 45 is reaching irrespective of increase or decrease this area would be called as under heat wave and if i want to know this condition we are observing in which part of india mainly central india and uh, other than himalayas and other than very coastal zone normally heat wave we are observing either thar desert or vidarbha area or telangana area or bundelkhand area inland area more chances could you tell me that uh, this heat wave condition uh, that is occurring with more frequency what may be the reason behind that global warming or el nino kind of condition prevailing more so that's why first time national disaster management authority ndma has given in 2016 proper guidelines to tackle the heat wave in the country for heat wave earlier heat wave was not considered as a disaster in india but now we are considering disaster and which authority of india first time has given the guidelines on heat wave 2016 ndma and ndma recently also conducted one workshop on heat wave with the telangana government because telangana we are observing in summer season badly affected with heat wave the workshop also conducted on heat wave how to handle the heat wave telangana has seen more death telangana andhra thousand people already died in telangana and andhra could you tell me that uh, uh, which city has better mechanism to deal with heat wave in the country one model is generally discussed ahmedabad model to deal with the heat wave of the basically uh, which kind of uh, uh, things ahmedabad has uh, evolved first of all forecasting of the heat wave then 
in for any disaster first first of all people should know that uh, it is normal day or uh, day of heat wave forecasting in advance that uh, don't go outside today would be the heat wave for example it would be the first you can say important thing second thing uh, in ahmedabad that they go for spraying or uh, sprinkling of water on the road you know it very well if spraying of water on the road or sprinkling of water on the road then uh, what would happen heat would be absorbed by changing water into water vapor so heat would be absorbed considerably by throwing the water so generally in summer season people used to draw throw the water on the surrounding area to decrease the heat amount so spraying of water on the road and third thing uh, what is done there that working hours even change generally people start their work in early time uh, laborer for example rather than for afternoon time because maximum heat would be at which time 2 pm 3 pm when sun is above then above it then more heat and within one or two hour rock will become very hot so 2 pm 3 pm it is high temperature time so generally 11 am or before that for people work should be finished so forecasting <laughs> spraying the water working and even to avoid heat stroke or dehydration or any kind of heat wave problem then uh, pau system or drinking water availability everywhere drinking water availability in summer season time not only ahmedabad but even in delhi you will feel that you go outside on karol bag road the same road in front of you it would be very difficult to stay for few minutes in open so our city area really has become which kind of land heat island so we are observing that uh, our cities have become heat island because more concrete surface which have which is absorbing more heat and also in concrete surface less water more water uh, in this particle less water so if sunlight is coming then uh, what lack of water is not causing water vapor so heat is not being absorbed by the concrete surface soil has proper moisture it is falling if you take two example one is concrete surface and one is uh, simple soil then soil has more water particle because gap is there soft structure this one but it has very less uh, water particle then if sunlight will fall more in summer season then sunlight if falling on the soil then maximum heat would be used to make this water of the soil into water vapor unfortunately in concrete surface very less amount of water is available in upper portion of concrete surface then uh, it will be directly absorbed by the surface rather than changing into water vapor so heat is not Uh, used you can say so more temperature we are observing on concrete surface or bitumen surface uh, you can say even in city area due to more demand of the land less vegetation less shade so deforestation is also you can say one of the reason so deforestation more concrete surface less soil moisture in the city area making this area you can say which kind of area in recent time heat island temperature in the evening time is even more than 10 degree celsius from the surrounding area of the village so 5 to 10 degree celsius temperature uh, you can say generally we observe higher side in city area so more problem we are observing of heat wave or heat island especially in urban area a lot can you tell me uh, that uh, recent time due to global warming which year uh, has been discussed the hottest year earlier 14 has been recorded in the hottest year 14 has uh, 14 record has been broken by 15 15 record has been broken by 16 so har saal agle saal se garam hota ja raha hai maybe 17 break uh, let's hope that it will not break the record but even we are observing that 17 summer remain quite hot so world is definitely facing global warming condition 
and uh, especially 2016 july was the hottest july ever in entire timing of temperature calculation pehli but temperature calculation we started from this year 1880 thermometer use temperature calculation of the earth 1880 onwards july 2016 has been the hottest july ever so it is clearly indicating that summer season has become extremely hot uh, and country like india that is known for tropical climate is definitely going to be affected a lot and that's why in summer season we are observing heat wave like condition and also which kind of uh, problem due to more rising of air more formation of high cloud and uh, in high cloud which thing we observe even the hail storm ole girna so we are observing more hail storm nowadays due to more rising due to more temperature of the air then height of the cloud is more even ice formation at the top and then hail storm more so heat wave hail storm even low wind even more thunder storm you can say more lightning you can say so incidence of lightning incidence of local hot wind low all are increasing so this season is uh, quite difficult time in india especially for those people those are weaker section those work uh, in open field those don't have ac in their room so it would be re really prob problematic for these people and uh, even hail storm damaging their crop when low incidence also causing problem for this area 